Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. In today's recipe tutorial, I will be showing you step by step how to make the best Nigerian egg rolls. This egg rolls tutorial is the most detailed ever, as I will be showing you some eating techniques of making egg rolls. And trust me, your egg rolls will no longer be breaking off while frying. This is Lighthard Catering TV. Welcome to my channel. First thing first, I'm boiling all the fresh eggs to be used for the egg rolls. I put them in a clean pot, added water to heat, and to the water, I equally added a teaspoon of salt. If you want to know why I added salt to the water, let me know in the comment section. I stirred it properly so that the salt will be properly dissolved. I'm taking it to the burner where it's going to boil for the next 15 minutes. Here are the other ingredients. 2 cups of flour, properly sieved. Milk, sugar, butter, nutmeg, baking powder, fresh egg, vegetable oil for frying. Here is the flour. I'm combining all the ingredients together. Sugar first, salt, nutmeg, baking powder, Then you stir them together. After they are properly mixed, I pull them aside. I break the one fresh egg I'm mixing into the flour. I break it and mix it properly. I usually like to mix my eggs separately before adding it to the flour. Into the flour, I added the butter. I continue to mix the butter very well until a breadcrumb texture is achieved. If you are seeing this channel for the first time, please subscribe and don't forget to like this video for others to see. And I added my beaten egg, the fresh egg I added it into the flour. I mixed it properly. Then I added milk. I'm adding the milk bit by bit so that the pastry will not be too soft or too watery. I added another batch of the milk. I mixed it. Then the last batch, because the pastry can take all the milk. So I added it and I mix it properly. I mix the pastry very well until all the ingredients are combined. Can you see my pastry? Moderately okay. So I'm covering it kitchen napkin to rest for 10 minutes. 15 minutes later, my boiled eggs are ready to be transferred into a bowl of cold water. Now begin to peel the eggs one after the other. If you are joining this channel for the first time, please don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video. Wow, the eggs are neatly peeled. I use paper towel to keep them dry. 10 minutes later, I brought out my pastry. I dusted a tray and I put it aside where I will be putting the eggs roll. I dusted a tray with flour to be putting the egg rolls. So here is my pastry on the table. I cut them into six equal parts, each part for each egg. So here is how to mold the eggs. Please pay attention to the details I'm trying to show here. Make sure the pastry is well flattened using the palm of your hands. Then put the eggs inside the pastry and try to cover it up with your ends can you see how i'm doing it i seal it up i seal it up properly then i turn the egg grow to cut the excess pastry off then i mold it until smooth you flatten your pastry very well put your egg inside the pastry 
and seal it up. Ensure all the edges meet at the spot. Then turn it, cut the excess pastry off and roll it. Roll it very well until it is smooth. Too much baking powder, too cold oil or too hot oil are not sealing the hair grow properly are the major reason hair grows usually break off while frying. So watch Here out. Here is our hair grows ready to be fried. While frying your hair grows, you have to keep turning them to allow them to be evenly done and to have uniform color. Here is our hair grow ready to be removed from the hot oil. Can you see their golden brown colors? It's yummy, yummy. Wow. So kindly give this video a, a thumb up and please don't forget to subscribe. The more you like this video, the more other people will be able to see it. Thank you.